Group students into pairs and give each pair a piece of wax paper as well as a copy of the attached handout called Plate Tectonics. Place a spoonful of pudding on the wax paper for each pair of students. The pudding represents the layer of lava, or the mantle on which Earth's crust floats. Give each pair of students one long graham cracker broken in half. The two halves represent two of Earth's plates. To model the first way the plates can move in relation to each other, students place the graham crackers side by side gently on the pudding. They slide the two crackers against each other in opposite directions, slightly bumping and scraping while sliding. Explain to students that this is what happens when two plates slide and that this motion frequently causes earthquakes. To find earthquakes, and inform the students that earthquakes are frequent along the San Andreas Fault in California, a famous example of a transform boundary. Be sure students observe that the pudding acts as a cushion but does not come up through the plates. Have students fill in the related blocks on the worksheet, citing earthquakes under effects. Ask students to move the graham crackers apart and observe that an opening occurs and that the pudding is clearly evident. Explain that this movement is called divergent. It causes openings in the Earth's crust out of which lava may flow or in which trenches may form. Have students fill in the related blocks in the worksheet, listing the Mid-Atlantic Ridge and the Atlantic Ocean as an example, and trenches, earthquakes, and mountain ranges under effects. Ask the students to push the graham crackers back together. Instruct some pairs of students to let one cracker slide under the other, and other pairs to bring them together with some force, causing some cracking and breaking, but causing them both to rise up into a mountain form. Explain to the students that this is an example of convergence, or coming together. Again, have students fill in the related blocks in the worksheet, listing the Rocky Mountains and the Himalayas, as well as the Mariana Trench, as examples of this kind of movement. Have students list mountain ranges, trenches, and volcanoes under effects. Have students look over their plate tectonics chart to ensure that they have completed each of the entries.